Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of Fishing Planet. And yes, guys, I am back in the Everglades. Everglades? The Everglades at the Salty Delta, and uh, the St. Patrick's Day event is over, and it was a lot of fun. And I was able to get a couple of decent episodes out of it, and I hope you enjoyed them. But it's now time to move on to some of these new species, especially these species here in the Everglades. Now, just like I had shown before in some previous episodes, I think it was the first of the St. Patrick's Day episodes, you can now look at the different species of fish, guys. And here's some of the new ones that have been put into the thing. Obviously, we saw the common snook. And you can take a good look at it in 3D here. There he is, and it comes in common, trophy, and unique. Apparently they have a unique Florida gar now. Here's the gaff topsail catfish. This is what this fellow looks like. And it is a marine type catfish. You can tell where it gets the topsail part of its name. That dorsal fin. <laughs> Pretty cool looking, isn't it? And the last but not least, the red drum. Red drum. Red drum. Red drum. Red drum. Red drum. No, guys, not that kind of red drum. This kind of red drum. <laughs> This is a very large fish, guys. This is up there with the tarpon in size for this particular location. And that's the one I'm going to be shooting for this episode. They only come in common and trophy size. There are no uniques, but they're so darn big, I guess it really doesn't matter all that much. Anyway, guys, I'm going to show you what I'm going to be fishing with because these species are so big that we're going to need to use a bit bigger rod here. We can't use the the gear that I was using previously. Now you can use a Phoenix rod for this kind of thing, so it's not really, you know, it doesn't really have to be the Brutus, but the Brutus is going to make it so much easier. Now I'm using my Brutus 9 foot by 10 inch rod, and I'm using my Redfish 5500 reel. Again, the reel isn't as big of a deal. You need to have a decent reel, but something that can go with the Phoenix. I'm using Floral 0.018 uh, line and this line is about 25 pound test. I would suggest using at least 12 to 15 pound test guys. And we're gonna start off with shrimps because it doesn't tell you all the things it goes for exactly. It says something to the effect that it goes for small crustaceans and it does go after small fish. So that's what we're going to start with is the shrimp guys and I've got my lead set to 99 inches and we're going to start off with a three knot hook because I don't know you know the, the mouths on these things look fairly small so that's what I'm going with guys anyway let's get on to it guys let's start with the shrimp and let's try over here in this area yeah, I never noticed that there were some stick-ups over there. Yeah, I haven't seen a lot of flopping, flop, flippity flopping of the fish out there, so... 
We'll start around 5 a.m. If nothing happens, I'll advance time a little bit. Anyway, guys, let's just kind of... It's not quite reaching the bottom, is it? Let's pull it forward just a little bit. See if it's any deeper. Yeah, that's about right. I think we just need to be patient, guys. Okay, if anything happens, I'll bring you back. Whoa! Oh, crap! I'm sorry, guys. I was not ready for that. I was just, like, kind of zoned out. <laughs> and something bit at it. Quickly. Oh, wow. Wow. Whatever this is, it's pretty good size. What have we got here? There it is! New personal record, red drum, awesome! Look, 518 cash, guys. Not bad. Ooh, he's shiny. He's a shiny fish. All right, I'm going to keep him. 92 XP. That's nothing to sneeze at. Let's try that again, guys. All right, that looks like a good spot. We'll just wait and see if we can catch a few. Hopefully he can get us a trophy. That would be awesome. Oops. Sorry about that. I hit my... I bumped my little computer. God bless it. They do not give you any warning at all. <laughs> I mean, I'm singer. Will. <laughs> good thing is they don't steal the bait too easy, so that's good. Ooh, this guy's big. This is a big old feller. Come on, big guy. Come on, big guy. Let's take a look at you. Yeah, he was bigger than the last one. 643, 21.165 pounds. Impressive. Let me get a get him in the light here. That is a nice fish. All right, let's try let's try something. He said small fish, so let's try let's try these minnows. See if they go for that. And let's see if they might have them over here too. We don't want to just limit ourselves. All right, looks like it's deep enough. Again, let's just wait. When you see me go, oh my God, I will have gotten one. <laughs> all right guys i have been fishing for a quite a little while with the minnows and haven't had a whole lot of luck i don't know if it's because i was fishing in this direction or if it's because i was fishing with minnows let's try something a little bit bigger let's try shiners this time I think I'm going to go with a bigger hook, too. Let's see. Let's go put a... I've got four rods here. All 
Alright. I'm going to try out there where I've been catching them. Well, this time I'm going to use shiners with a four odd hook. Alright guys, I have been fishing for a while and I have gotten no bites. Like I said, they don't indicate what exactly they go for, so it's a little bit of trial and error. I wonder if you can purchase crawfish in this map. I'm not sure if you can or not, because I don't have any on me. I've left them in my old backpack. I don't know why. <laughs> Honest to God, I don't know why. Let's see here. Baits. Fresh baits. Shiner's a medium cut bait. Medium cut bait. That's interesting. Hmm. Tell you what, guys. Let's try this. It ain't gonna hurt. Let's track medium cut bait. Maybe they go for that. You never know. I'll be damned. It's the cut bait, guys. It's the cut bait, medium cut bait. Shrimp and medium cut bait. And I am going to be have to check out crawfish. Okay, he's decent sized. Come on, be a trophy this time, guys. No, not a trophy, but we got one. There we go. Alright, well... That's three of them, guys. I think I'm going to continue fishing, and if I happen to catch a trophy while I do this, I will put it at the end of this video. So let's take a look here, guys. It looks like we got these guys off of shrimps and medium cut bait. And the biggest one was 21 pounds, and that was 164 XP. Not bad and 643 cash I'm not complaining about that not one bit let's take a look at this guy there he is there you go guys so far that's my personal record of the red drum 21.165 inches I mean pounds 37.796 inches so, like I said, if we happen to catch a trophy, I'll bring you back, but for now, so please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode. Until then, bye-bye.